Always tracking, always alerting. Here's your Storm Track 15 weather. Welcome back. Another cool start to our morning. Obviously, a little foggy out there. I don't <laughs> even know what that is a picture of or what we're looking at, but time to check in with Adam. Nonetheless, what do you have for us? Well, Alex, I'm actually in meteorologist heaven right now because uh, okay. this is one of the coolest things. Typically, you see this forming maybe on the west coast of the United States. Talk about San Francisco. It's a shallow layer of fog that is just making its way through the area here, and it's so dense but you can see some of the impacts here. Uh, we're looking at downtown. There's the Chase Tower there. You're also seeing barely the Iberia Bank Tower. But look at how there's a light wind flow going across and you're getting some of these eddies, some turbulence as the wind passes over the buildings here, creating these little pockets of up and down motion. And sometimes you get these little wave features going through. Very fascinating. We usually don't see this. Our buildings aren't super tall. The Chase Tower only 200 feet. So this fog layer has been waning in depth between 150, 175 feet. And it's something interesting that we never typically see. Above this, clear skies thanks to high pressure. We call that a subsidence inversion, where high pressure sits on top. It's warmer air keeping all the air bottled down closer to the surface. A very fascinating sight early this morning. 50 degrees in Lafayette, 55 in Opelousas, 50 in New Iberia. Everyone reporting fog. It is a very foggy morning out there. A jacket needed early this morning. Not so much by the afternoon. You can see we warm up into the mid and upper 70s. Some clouds in the sky. We have a dense fog advisory through 9 o'clock this morning. Here's the area of high pressure that is causing all this quiet weather and also keeping that fog layer pretty held tight close to the surface. Again, those high temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. Some of us maybe even 80 degrees today. We'll see. Big turnaround from this morning. Tonight, look for more fog. Those temperatures dropping off into the lower 50s. And then tomorrow, 77. We're talking about clouds, though, building in the afternoon. And that trend continues here through the weekend, though I'm not talking about any rain. So the Sun Belt uh, Championship game on Saturday, Alex, looks fine. Just very warm out there in those mid and upper 70s. Next week, though, very tumultuous weather pattern. Multiple fronts, some cool air, thunderstorms, hmm. all sorts of things. Okay, so it'll be eventful in the weather world next yes. week. Okay, well, we'll, we'll uh, stand by for that and we'll also check in in just a bit.